and welcome back to Hidden Gems, the show where we profile some of world football's hottest young talents. Today, we're looking at 23-year-old Englishman Lloyd Kelly. Captain of Bournemouth in the central of their defence, Lloyd Kelly has been instrumental in Bournemouth's rise from the Championship into the Premier League for the forthcoming season. And yeah, he's, he's done really well this season. I've been very impressed when I've seen him. He's looked like a commanding leader, very, very comfortable on the ball, a solid, solid uh, defender just all round very good defensively very good playing with the ball at his feet all that kind of stuff do you want to give me some of his stats for this season the championship some of his I mean, overlying numbers he's played, 40, he's played 41 games out of 46 yeah only 5 games missed over 4,000 minutes of football only 1 goal and 1 assist but obviously I'm you know, again not expecting those numbers to be high for a defender of course uh, and a 7.24 average shot rating but it's his defensive stats that really stand yeah, out. Well, well, I mean, on the goal and assist, he's played centre half and he's still got a goal and assist, which very, very decent. But yeah, tactical success rate. Do you want to go for that? I mean, he's got 62% in the Championship season, which compared to Virgil Van Dijk in the Premier League, uh, Virgil Van Dijk has 63%. And you consider when Kelly's probably making more tackles. Because he plays for Bournemouth and not Liverpool, and because he's played in the Championship and not the Premier League, that's very decent. That his success rate is very close to Van, 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 Van Dyke. In terms of passing success rate, eighty-two percent for Kelly, ninety percent for Van Dyke. Not too much difference there. Of course, it's a lot harder to pass yeah. in the Premier League, but equally, your teammates at Liverpool are going to be of a higher quality than the teammates yeah. at Kelly at Bournemouth. Yeah. So. You could, uh, you know, it kind of works both ways. So for them to be quite close in both of those stats, it's very interesting. But yeah, all round a very, very solid for season, for a very, very solid season yeah. for Kelly. I'll be intrigued to see how he gets on the prem. I, I mean, mean, the fact he's already a captain at twenty three yeah, says a lot about him. Very good player, very good defender, a great leader in the back of that Bournemouth defence. And I think if Bournemouth are to stay up in the Premier League, it will be because of him, or he'll play a main part in it. Do you think he could be in the England squad? Not this winter, I think that's no chance, no, but no, in the future. No. I mean, definitely. definitely. If Ming, I mean, if Mings can get there, there's yeah, anyone yeah. can. Yeah, Kelly, just 23 years old. I'd expect him to be in the England setup within mm. the next four years. I think, yeah, he demonstrate. he's a very good centre-half. Can play in either a two or a three, which I think makes him very useful. And he can do a job at left-back. In fact, he yeah. was a left-back until... Very recently, so, so like the last yeah. two seasons. Yeah, very, Definitely very left, strong. Left side of back three. Very, very yeah, good. very strong for Kelly. Anyway, that's all for today's video. Make sure to leave your thoughts on Kelly and Bournemouth, how you think his season went, their season went, how you think him and they will get on in the Premier League this season. We've got a Bournemouth podcast coming out on Wednesday, so make sure to check that out. If if you if all the Bournemouth fans have converged onto this yeah. video, then go look out for that on Wednesday. But yeah, thank you all very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. See ya.